Welcome to my channel. My name is Salindria, and I'm a mom who's trying to get my family to financial freedom. I'm paid bi-weekly for my full-time job and paid two times per month for my part-time job. Today, I am going to unstuff my cash envelopes that I carry with me so I can see what I have remaining to go into my March Madness. So excited about this. Um, so I am working on some other savings challenges, but I've paused all of those um, because I do use my rollover typically for those. Um, and I decided to use my rollover for the March Madness. Um, so let's go ahead and jump right in and see what we have remaining. First up, Mommy has $20. And you guys, I did work really hard to try not to spend wherever I could make sure I could save something for March Madness. So gas is um, has ten dollars remaining. Groceries has twenty five dollars. Next up is household, which has nothing. Miscellaneous has the ten dollars that we started with, um, and nothing left in personal. So let me just count up and see what I have left over here. What is going into March Madness, you're asking me? 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65 dollars going into my March Madness. I'm not going to count it um, today, but at the end of the month I will for sure count it and let you know how everything went for this. What I'm actually taking to the casino um, when I go with my mom at the end of the month. So March Madness. 65 bucks today. Pretty excited about it. So let's go ahead and stuff my envelopes in. These are binders, or dividers, not binders, dividers. Um, I'm carrying dividers right now because I'm carrying a little crossbody. But let's go ahead and see what we're putting into my dividers and my cash envelopes uh, for my cash expenses. So I have 100, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200. 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay, so $220 are going into my um, cash expenses. And um, let's go ahead and jump right in with mommy is getting $30. So we have 20, 30. Gas is getting $20. And gas has gone up, so um, I pushed it to the limit by trying to hang on to that $10 um, this past week. So groceries are getting $100. Household getting $10. And miscellaneous getting $10. Personal $10. So that's it for my dividers that I'm carrying with me. And this is the little binder that I have my cash expenses in right now. Um, so we'll go ahead and get started with uh, my kiddo's allowance, which is getting $10. So we have five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten dollars $10. And I'd like to get this in all ones, but I'm struggling to get the denominations that I need. So next up is beauty, which is getting $10, and health is getting $10, but I was not able to get my hands on as the denominations I needed, so I'm just going to put a 20 in beauty, and then I will make sure when I get the change to put it in health. Alright, and next up um, is pets, which is getting $10. So my kiddos were saving their money, they were holding on tight for dear life, and then they decided they would um, buy something, we went to Walmart. So they're a little low, they still have something in there, but they're a little low. Um, so they've got to work hard to build that back up. Um, so they did overhear a conversation about Disneyland, so they're asking can we go for their birthday. So I'm trying to sort through and figure out my finances as far as the stimulus is concerned, tax return, whatever, because um, I have some really big savings goals. Um, I know that I'm paying off um, one of one of my credit cards and then a couple of other debts. So I'm going to see how we can manage the money and maybe get my kids to Disneyland. They're saying they want to go for their birthday, which would be tons of fun. 
Um, I did find out that they're going to open up um, sometime in April and their birthday is in June. So I don't know. I'll keep you guys posted and let you know how everything goes. But that is it for this cash stuffing. You guys, there's uh, March Madness still going strong. So feel free to join in, connect with us, see what we've got going on. Um, I know that this coming week is another giveaway. So stay tuned for that. And please like, share, comment, and subscribe. All of those things that can keep us connected, you guys. I thank you so much for all of your support and love. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.